Going to explain how to open an XML file in QGIS. There isn't a direct built-in way to open and display a generic XML file as a map layer in QGIS like you would with a shapefile or geo package. XML files themselves don't contain geographic information directly, they're just data containers. To use the data within an XML file in QGIS, you need to first understand the structure of the XML and then use either the QGIS processing toolbox or external tools to transform that XML data into a format QGIS can understand, such as a shapefile, GeoJSON, or a table. 1. Understanding your XML structure. This is crucial. Open your XML file in a text editor or XML viewer. Many free ones are available online. Carefully examine the tags and their hierarchy. Identify which parts of the XML contain the geographic coordinates, latitude and longitude or UTM coordinates, and other attributes you want to map. You'll need to know this information to process the data correctly. 2. Using the QGIS Processing Toolbox for simpler XMLs. If your XML is relatively straightforward and has coordinates clearly defined within easily parsed tags, you might be able to use the Processing Toolbox. Go to Processing, Toolbox. Search for tools related to XML, text file, or vector creation. Some tools, depending on their capabilities and your XML structure, might allow you to directly import and convert the data. You will likely need to specify the location of your XML file, the delimiters used in your data, often commas or tabs, and which columns represent X and Y coordinates. Experiment with different tools. Success depends heavily on the specific structure of your XML file. The output will usually be a point, line, or polygon layer depending on your data. 3. Using external tools and scripting for complex XMLs. For more complex XML files, the processing toolbox might not be sufficient. You'll probably need to use external tools or programming languages like Python to parse and convert the XML data into a usable format. Popular Python libraries for XML parsing include write single quote xml.etree.elementtree write single quote and lxml. You'd write a script to extract the geographic data and other attributes, format them correctly, and then write them into a new file, like a CSV, which can then be imported into QGIS using the Add Delimited Text Layer tool. Remember to specify the correct coordinate reference system, CRS, when importing the data into QGIS. 4. Importing the converted data. After converting your XML data using one of the methods described above, you'll have a file in a GIS-compatible format, CSV, GeoJSON, Shapefile, etc. Import this new file into QGIS using the appropriate method, for example, layer, add layer, add vector layer. Ensure that the coordinate reference system, CRS, of the newly imported data is correctly defined. You might need to manually set the CRS if QGIS does not automatically detect it. In summary, there's no single button to open XML in QGIS. You need to first understand the XML structure, then either use the QGIS processing toolbox for simple cases or write a script using Python, or a similar language, and an appropriate XML parsing library for more complex cases to convert the XML data into a GIS-ready format before importing it into QGIS.